Luke, there you are. What you doing running away like that? Luke, speak to me, kid. Hiya, Mikey. Glad you could make it. I've been waiting for you. I was scared. Scared they were gonna catch me. That you weren't gonna come get me. Here, Luke. You should have known I'd always be there for you, bro. There were bad things in the dark. Badder than the boogeyman. They did stuff to me. Stuff I don't want to think about. Oh, God. I'm sorry, Luke. Hey, you want to hear a joke, Mikey? Sure. Once upon a time, there was a murderer and his victim walking hand in hand towards some deep, dark woods. The victim squeezes the murderer's hand real tight. He says, looking up pleadingly with big brown eyes, I'm really scared, mister, of the deep, dark woods. Luke, what the hell? He sighs and he says, you're scared. How the hell do you think I feel? I'm going to be walking back through them on my own. Pretty funny, hey, Mikey? Pretty goddamn amusing, don't you think? You ain't Luke. You ain't my brother. that I am done for. You didn't reckon on the fact that the dark souls I now possess would give me even greater power. Power enough to take you down. You might think that. But unfortunately, and once again, you are woefully mistaken. What the? Jesus! Now you will die! One flaw in your plan, Legion. The Dark Souls have given me the power to defeat you. I've read my prophecy. And Legion shall take the Dark Souls unto him. Well, here they are. I think it's time to make a fast exit. Bloody done it! Looks like you owe me that drink, Michael. I am the Lord of Deadside, walker between the worlds, immortal voodoo warrior. As a god, I stamp upon the writhing face of the Deadside Serpent. Weapon in my hand, 
my hand. The arcing death blow. The horror. The horror. I embrace it. Luke, there you are. What you doing running away like that? Luke, speak to me, kid. Hiya, Mikey. Glad you could make it. I've been waiting for you. I was scared, scared they were gonna catch me, that you weren't gonna come get me. Here, Luke, you should have known I'd always be there for you, bro. There were bad things in the dark. Better than the boogeyman. They did stuff to me. Stuff I don't want to think about. Oh, God. I'm sorry, Luke. Hey, you want to hear a joke, Mikey? Sure. Once upon a time, there was a murderer and his victim walking hand in hand towards some deep, dark woods. The victim squeezes the murderer's hand real tight. He says, looking up pleadingly with big brown eyes, I'm real scared, mister, of the deep, dark woods. Luke, what the hell? He sighs and he says, you're scared. How the hell do you think I feel? I'm going to be walking back through them on my own. Pretty funny, hey, Mikey. Pretty goddamn amusing, don't you think? You ain't Luke. You ain't my brother. Congratulations. You win the booby prize. It was never your brother. Just a little insurance to get you here. Really, Michael, you must learn to let the dead rest in peace. Who are you? And he asked him. What is thy name? And he replied, My name is Legion, for we are many. And you, Shadow Man, are Legion also. The souls of the many fill your vitals to bursting. To hell with this obscure shit. I don't need it. All I need to know is that I'm gonna take you down. You really don't get it, do you? You're even more of a posturing fool than I first believed. When I came up with my grand and incredibly brilliant plan, which you will know as the prophecy, all those years ago... What? You created the prophecy? Of course I did, you pillock. Surely you didn't believe all that bollocks about the old gods imparting the knowledge to the ancients. The only god back then was me. It was I who spoke to the ancients in their dreams and planted the seed for my triumphant return. Of course, all those years ago, I couldn't have hoped for a more willing puppet. Luckily, the puppet is you, Michael Lavoie. And of course, now that you have so kindly presented poor Luki with his teddy bear, it is impossible for you to leave. You bastard! Thank you. I suppose you've read the Le Cat, for it is written, and Legion took the power of the Dark Souls unto him. I knew that the Dark Souls would be difficult to get, and I needed someone to bring them to me. And here you are, replete with their immortal power, a power I require to energize my Dark Engine and project my armies across the Vale to Liveside as it was in the beginning, is now, and forever shall be. It isn't over yet. Oh, I think it is, Michael. Well and truly over. We spoke the word to Pike, Batrachian, Cruz, and the others, so that they might open the way. We whispered sweet nothings into Nettie's ear as she lay sleeping, and she sent you to us. Like the proverbial lamb, 
to the slaughter man. The power is within you, Shadow Man. The power to unleash the apocalypse upon your pissant little world. The throne awaits you, Michael Lavoie. You are the fuel for a great engine, as it was in the beginning, is now, and forever shall be. Amen to that! Alas, it would appear that I am done for. You didn't reckon on the fact that the Dark Souls I now possess would give me even greater power. Power enough to take you down. You might think that. But unfortunately, and once again, you are woefully mistaken. What the f***? Jesus! Now you will die! I thought I the ring This was the one flaw in your plan, Legion. The Dark Souls have given me the power to defeat you. I've read my prophecy. And Legion shall take the Dark Souls unto him. Well, here they are. <laughs> 
I think it's time to make a fast exit. My God, the lad's got him bloody done it. Looks like you owe me that drink, Michael. I am the Lord of Deadside. Walker between the worlds. Immortal voodoo warrior. As a god, I stamp upon the writhing face of the dead side serpent. Weapon in my hand. My hand, the arcing death blow. The horror, the horror. I embrace it. <laughs> 